Very many of you people have disturbing questions in your brain. You may have money to start with, but when and how to start your farming stays a frequent question ever. I took longer without moving you around this farm. Let me do it as I narrate when and how I started my farming on these 12 acres of land. As the sun rises, welcome back to Muse Chicks YouTube channel. Muse Chicks is my name, always here to inspire everyone into farming. I was born in a small village in eastern Uganda, Africa, and in a poor family where it was hard for my parents to put food on a table three times a day. I grew up with a dream of becoming a farmer and I feed nations. Here I am today, my farming, my story. We start, they start, everyone starts farming differently. But at the end of the day, we end at the same point. Of course, others start as a hobby, just for fun. Uh, others start it uh, with the purpose of making money. But either you're starting uh, with the purpose of making money, either you start it as a hobby, we all uh, end at the same point, earning something and feeding the nation. I'm recording right in my one of my god's house as i say that i will be moving you around the farm uh, as we discuss how and when to start farming as i will be relating to myself as always i'm here to inspire and encourage you to start immediately guys i always uh, say that just start right now don't wait to start tomorrow in this statement, sometimes I mean uh, there are those people who always have money to start. They have everything, they have land, but they still hesitate to start. Just maybe for one reason, uh, they feel they are not ready at the moment to start. Others just think maybe to abandon their paying jobs to get into farming. Guys, I don't mean that if you have to start farming, you have to abandon your current job where you're earning something, or uh, you have to lose some of your things uh, to start farming. No, that's not the case. When to start and how to start is that very disturbing question ever. And at the end of the day, it stops us to start our farming. Guys, if you want to start farming, maybe if you want to start with the chickens or as my campaign of local chickens, if you want to start with goats, uh, cows, or you want to grow crops, it's just only uh, stands on these three things one you have to have that passion of farming you have to have that passion of farming as you know very well uh, even in other businesses even in other jobs even in other professions if you don't have passion to that profession, guys, you will be working, but you are in a wrong place. Even if you will be there uh, and your target is to earn something, 
or to earn money, but you are in a longer place. At the end of the day, you will not get or you will not reach your goals. Reason being, you will be limited somewhere. Because you are there, but you don't have that passion of being there. You just there to earn something. So you will be limited in a certain corner. You will not express yourself. You will not exercise everything. You will not practice. You will not make enough research. You will not create. It's the same to farming. If you're coming this way, or if you want to start your farming, just with the uh, one thing of just making money, uh, guys, at the end of the day, you will be disappointed. That's one thing. My starting, uh, it was not all about maybe I had a lot of money. Uh, it was not all about that I had and everything uh, I was supposed to have uh, for a start. But it was just uh, that passion of starting. I started somewhere working on a certain farm. But I was there just for one reason. Uh, I had that passion of farming. Of course, where I started from, we had chickens, uh, we had goats, we had plants, we had coffee uh, at the farm. So, reason being, I had that passion. So, I got that chance to exercise everything. I got that chance to make enough research about my uh, about how I'm going to start my farming. So, I used that chance to start my farming. Uh, just for one reason, I had passion. Then, another thing, you have... Uh, to start uh, your farming with goals. I don't know whether you will understand this one, but you have uh, your goals of starting farming or your goals of farming should be more than making money from farming. <laughs> Uh, your goals of starting farming or oh, your goals of farming should be more than uh, just making money from farming. Your goals. Uh, I'll give you an example uh, that uh, when I was still young, uh, as you've heard my story, of course. I grew in that family where my parents uh, uh, can't afford to raise three meals on a table every day. So when I was growing, uh, my goal was I have to become a farmer so that I can also feed the nation. You see? those goals my goals of being a farmer of starting farming of doing farming was or oh, they are more than just making money from farming my dream was to start a farm and i feed the nation so i had trash and i put here a, a simple structure of gods and as my story always, I started with a few goats. But my dream was to feed the nation. Not to, by then, was not to make money out of my starting. So I started with a few goats in that simple structure. As I stayed there working on the other farm. So that was my beginning. And on this very note, hesitates many of you people to start your farming because every day you think that maybe to start farming you have to leave uh, your current job 
which is paying you by then and you join farming guys if you think like that you will be disappointed by farming and you hate it for life but what you have to do here uh you stay where you working you stay with that ani then you start this farming slowly 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 farming uh it's for those people who are patient because farming comes with lots of surprises today it will surprise you with the profits then tomorrow it will surprise you with maybe a loss so you have to put these into consideration before you start your farming don't just expect uh to leave maybe your job uh to come here uh to start farming as you expect to to start earning at that very time you start keep on investing then expect your earning tomorrow and any other advice here uh if you want to start farming first think of getting a job somewhere that will be financing your start i know this one will annoy most of you people because uh sometimes you think that when you start farming uh that's your job you starting your job it's very true it's you starting your very own job you starting your very own earning but not for today you starting your own job for earning tomorrow that's funny it's very funny but it's very enjoyable then any other point it's readiness 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 it covers a lot of things not only uh that startup cap you should have land uh you should have everything you have to start with but uh, readiness uh means quite a number of things one of these uh you have to be ready to sacrifice yourself to your farming uh i give an example uh some of you people you surprised you saw me before uh when i move like very many of you people on two legs and you surprised maybe when you see me uh moving on crutches guys this one happened as you know very well life changes within no time uh this incident just happened just recently two years back and it happened when i still work on the other farm it happened that i got uh an accident and i spent like eight months in the hospital as you know very well that exercising time uh it affects a lot i almost lost everything uh, i just remained maybe with this polo part but with a few animals with a few goats after eight months uh i had to come back i had to move out of hospital but with a lot of depression uh almost i lost hope but being i started my farming uh when i was ready i came back when i lost almost everything but at the same time with lots of pain i had to sacrifice to my farm because i saw my farm uh has already collapsed i had to sacrifice to see that my farm stands again i just came back here at the farm and to practice my farming on my crutches it was just for one reason that uh i was ready i started my farming when i was ready not being ready financial but being ready in everything uh you have to sacrifice every time every day when i reach here at the farm i have to get involved in everything in every practice 
taking place at my farm even if I have workers. Readiness is one of the things we consider uh, that maybe when and how to start your farming. Uh, to still move you around the farm, I had to create other opportunities here at the farm. Uh, that's why you see uh, uh, initially it was a goat's farm only. Uh, but now I have local chickens. Uh, it was after at the hospital I started my turkeys as you see. Uh, right now I have sheep and uh, if uh, I'm not forgetting uh, there is somebody who sent a request that maybe next time I talk about my sheep. Uh, I show you my sheep. Yeah guys as uh, always uh, my starting is to start with what I have by that time. So I started with the three sheep, but right now I'm reaching 12 uh, within just a period of one year because I started the sheep here one year back. So guys, this is my family and that's how I'm trying to move. Uh, right now, as you're seeing, I'm trying to clear my grazing grounds uh, on these 12 acres uh, so that the farm looks nice. Uh, I'm progressing every day. I showed you how I introduced the cows. Uh, I started with the one nighter right now, another one. Uh, called the PK1. So, uh, you see every day being I started with the, those three uh, elements, you see my farming or oh, you see my farm progresses every day, even though there are challenges always. First of all, first accept the challenges in farming before you start your farming. Uh, that's why today I'm here. Uh, my goals was to start my farming, to feed the nation, to feed my country. But maybe I saw it will be difficult for me in one way or any other. That's why I decided to start up this platform and uh, these campaigns of mine, of encouraging you people to start farming, of inspiring you people to get into farming. It's my pleasure when i see every day one or those two people join farming with that one i just know that my dreams are becoming true because uh, i'm feeding those few uh you feeding those few uh that one who is also starting will be feeding those few then another one who will be also starting tomorrow after being inspired uh, will be also feeding those few. So at the end of the day, I see myself feeding the nation. Let me end here for today. Mosaic Chicks, sign out.